Hello Air Signs, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius Welcome to my channel, this is Chelsea Thank you so much for liking and subscribing I really appreciate your love and support In this reading, we are going to get an update on how your person feel about you right now Please bear in mind that this is a general reading And it may not resonate with each and every one of you Spirits and angels, please show me How does Gemini, Libra and Aquarius person, I'll take this Feel about them right now Hierophant in reverse at the bottom of the deck. A person is really sad right now because we've got the Three of Swords here or Heartbroken. And also we've got the Page of Swords here because maybe they feel like you don't trust them. King of Cups here in reverse. And they may be feeling really overwhelmed right now. Definitely overwhelmed with sadness when the King of Cups is in reverse. It feels like the water is pouring down. So they're definitely feeling really sad right now because of the Four of Cups here. Perhaps you could have rejected them or feeling unfulfilled or something that you are unhappy in regards to them or in regards to whatever that, that may have happened between the two of you. It could have something to do with secrets with the moon here. Um, but the moon also may be an indication of them um, currently going through some depression, okay? And the king of cups and lovers also can indicate them feeling really emotionally unstable right now. And king of pentacles and lovers can be them feeling like uh, sad, depressed, because sad or depressed because they can't give you what you want, whatever it could be, something that is of value to you, okay? It can be something that. Uh, something material it could be commitment it could be marriage it could be anything that is uh, that you deem to be valuable to you that you need from them okay or that you want from them and that they can't quite provide that to you right now we've got the ace of swords here in my first i feel like both of you are not speaking with each other right now or that you are refusing to speak with them and we've got the ten of pentacles in my verse and the two of swords i feel like you've blocked them block them uh yeah it definitely for me indicates there's a, a blockage of communication all that they may be feeling like you don't want to hear them out okay in regards of future here ten of pentacles and lovers or anything that they've they're trying to explain to you ten of pentacles and lovers can indicate separation however on this row it feels like again all these pentacles can indicate family marriage or commitment right they feel like you either are not accepting what they are offering to you or that they feel that they can't give you what you want currently and you could be very dissatisfied with them and you could be questioning them with the page of swords here or just not trusting them let's see more gemini libra and aquarius Yeah, they're definitely unhappy, Ten of Cups. Well, there are two cards that indicate separation. Actually, three, four cards that indicate separation. Some of you, maybe both of you are separated on your way to separation. But the Hierophant in reverse, Queen of Pentacles in reverse, and the Five of Wands in reverse, they feel like you couldn't be bothered anymore. You're not fighting for this connection. You may have retrieved yourself from this connection or from a situation both of you could be facing right now the situation can be any situation yeah it may involve a third party third party may not always mean another lover it also can mean external factors internal factors friends family you could be meddling into this connection that could have caused us a heartbreak here through your swords or sadness hmm. or uncertainty so they may be feeling that the future for the both of you is very uncertain and they feel very vulnerable right now. Hmm. See, the king and the queen both are in reverse, but both are actually looking at each other even though in reverse. So both of you maybe still do care for each other or may want to know how how is the other person doing. Or maybe both of you are just not speaking with each other, but knowing that it is being done in purpose. However, there's also some confusion here. The moon, someone someone could hear. It could be you or your person. I don't know. It could switch this part. feels like someone here could be feeling uh, confused as, as to why 
this person is just not uh, investing in this connection um and we've got ace of pentacles here your person feels like you are the one for them you're somebody very precious to them very valuable to them they may be feeling like they would like to have this new beginning with you after something that may have happened with the ten of cups in reverse or nine of pentacles in reverse you could be dealing with a virgo capcom taurus strong earth that i'm seeing here could also be water sign uh pisces cancer scorpio it can be any sign okay but they feel like they really would like to offer you this commitment. Either you are rejecting them, thinking or saying it's something that they want to offer to you. It can be anything, but they feel like maybe it's not good enough for you. Hmm. To them, it's good enough, but to you, maybe it's not good enough. Let's see just a little bit more. Temperance in reverse. Well, they miss you for sure, right? Six of Cups, they miss you a lot. They constantly reminisce about the past, past memories, both of you have shared with each other. Two of Cups, when things were all romantic and sweet. And the death here is in reverse. They feel like they do not want this to end or that they're trying to avoid a permanent ending if both of you are already separated. And they feel very passionate about you, Queen of Wands here. However, for those of you, if you do know that if only if you're involved in a third party situation with this person if not this part of the story is not for you but i feel like uh, they feel like you know uh, you've already found out in regards of another person right and temperance in reverse it obviously doesn't uh they it doesn't sit well with them they feel like that could have caused some issues again either one of you may have been you know in a third party situation like whoever who has it could be you with somebody else or them with somebody else, okay? You could go vice versa like this. But they feel like that could be the cause of the separation or heartbreak, sadness. Um, hmm. But if there is no third party, they may be feeling that you're doing your own thing right now, Queen of Wands. You're making moves and you are so beautiful, so attractive. And it tempers them up first. It makes them feel even much more vulnerable because of that. They may also be feeling like their initial plan has failed. Whatever the plan could have been, it may have failed because perhaps, I mean, maybe they, they were not completely genuine or that you may have found out they're not completely genuine. Hmm. Let's just see a little bit more here. We've got the devil here. They feel very obsessive over you. Um, they can't let you go. They can't stop thinking about you no matter what. They feel very connected to you in a very unhealthy way. And Knight of Cups here is in love verse. Page Pentacles in love verse. They feel like maybe they've got some issues that they need to deal with, okay? Some issues, maybe some emotional issues. It feels like your person may not be in a good place right now. Again, it feels like they are kind of unstable. It can be because of depression. It could be because of addiction. Abuse can be anything that is unhealthy and toxic. But no matter what, they constantly think about the past. And again, good times both of you have shared with each other and they really don't want this to end. They would like to offer you something, but maybe there is a blockage uh, right now. It could be because of their emotional health, physical health, or it could be because of a third party or any situation that is not ideal for them or they're not at a position where it's ideal for them to give you what you want. All right, Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I will leave you with my latest videos on the screen right now. It's a travel vlog channel. Um, I'm in London right now. Has, I'm having so much fun. Only during the weekends. <laughs> Most of the days I'm working. But check it out if you want to. And uh, also, I'll leave you with a playlist on the screen. This playlist has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But they're still valid readings because you guys know that I post your videos almost every single day. And nowadays, it's been twice a week. Uh, sorry, twice a day. <laughs> so these readings are still valid. Um, and I hope... Uh, um, I was trying to say it. Sorry, I just got distracted. 
because I'm hearing something downstairs. So um, if you don't want to miss any of those messages, just click on that playlist, scroll all the way down, look for your sign. And also, I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. All right, take care. Bye.